You know, ladies and gentlemen, recently I uncovered a scandal involving millions of Americans who were being duped by a few large corporations. Now, let's face it, I'm not an investigative reporter by profession. Nonetheless, I risked my life making the film you're about to see. I'm well aware that by showing you this, I'm jeopardizing my job as well as the jobs of Paul Schaefer and the band. But believe me, it's worth it to inform the public about what's going on. Watch closely, if you will. I remember the evening it all started. It had been a pretty good day at work and I was returning to Mrs. Johnson's boarding house where I live. Hi, Mrs. Johnson. Hello, David. <laughs> when are you gonna finish that sweater? <laughs> what are you watching? It's our lucky night, the Cosby Show is on. Oh, great, I know he's one of your favorites. Uh, wait a minute, he's, uh, he's not on until Thursday night, is he? Oh, David, I don't ask questions. I just watch TV. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> is there? Are you sure this is Cosby? I think so. It's not one of their better episodes, though. Yeah. It just seems like there's a little something uh, off about the whole thing. Maybe it's the set. This is the CBS television oh my network. God. Uh, Mrs. Johnson, do you mind leaving the room for just a minute? Wait, David, what's the matter? Oh, nothing. Nothing serious, I, uh, I hope. <laughs> oh, and, uh, tell the other boarders not to come down here. You know, you're mighty pretty when you're mad. Oh, hi, Paul. Thanks for coming. Dave, you're white as a ghost. What's wrong? Yeah, I know. Sit down. I'll tell you about it. Uh, Paul, you know, earlier tonight, uh, I'm watching NBC, or at least I think I'm watching NBC. Well, it turns out that I'm watching CBS. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Paul, CBS is stealing ideas for television programs from NBC and putting them on their air. Dave, that's ridiculous. Uh, is this one of your comedy routines? Well, I wish it was. This, this thing, whatever I'm watching, it sounded just like the Cosby show, but uh, it was a cheap CBS imitation. All right, all right. This alleged show on CBS. Was it as good as Cosby? No, 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 no. That's just it. It had none of the warm, emotional content of the Cosby show. But do you think CBS cares? Jeez. David, are you going to stay up all night? It's almost midnight. You're frightening the other boarders. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, Mrs. Johnson. I'll, I'll be up in a couple of minutes. Hello, Mrs. Johnson. Paul Schaefer, I should have known it was you causing a stir. Get on home now. I never should have rented to show people. Listen, Paul, do me a favor. Tomorrow, go over to CBS and do some snooping around. Let me know what you find out. Well, all okay? right, if it'll make you feel better, Dave, yeah. but I think this is, sounds pretty far-fetched to me. Right. If anyone was going to believe me, I'd need plenty of evidence. So I spent all night reading everything I could get my hands on. I even thought I might uncover something by doing the TV Guide crosswords. Okay. <laughs> Eight blank enough is eight is enough that's right that's a that's an nbc show isn't it or is it my whole world was topsy-turvy but i had to keep going if not for my sake for the sake of the people i love the more i read the more dirt i uncovered and by morning every illusion i had about tv was shattered who is it dave Dave, it's me. Oh, geez, Paul, come on in, come on in. Oh, my God, Paul, who did this to you? CBS? Dave, this is bigger than CBS. ABC is in on it, too. They've got a new show that's a ripoff of Miami Vice. Oh, sit down, sit down, take care of yourself. Listen, this is the kind of thing that has been going on for years. You remember MASH, the CBS show that everybody thought was so great? Yeah. Well, it turns out before it was a TV show, it was a movie. And you know the odd couple? That was a movie and a play. Oh. Yeah, but that's not the worst of it. They're even stealing people. Remember Captain Kirk on the great show on NBC, Star Trek? Yeah. Okay. Look at this. T.J. Hooker, an ABC show. It's the same guy. What are we going to do? I'll tell you what we're going to do. We've got to make the world listen. We've got to tell people. We've got to make them believe it. God. Oh, no. Look at that. Come back here, you cowards. <laughs> Hello, David. Oh, my 
head. Uh, where am I? Hello, David. Good evening. Tom Brokaw? David, look, I'm sorry that we had to knock you out like that and rough up your little friends, but you must understand, we just can't let this information out. Wait a minute, you're behind all of this? Dave, actually, I wish that I were, but like everyone else here at NBC, I'm just a stooge for Bill Cosby. Wait a minute, I don't get it. He, he was the one being ripped off. Hey, come on, Dave, don't be so naive. The fact is that NBC is just as guilty as the other networks. Even Nightly News, the Today Show, we all steal from each other. And all of your favorite NBC entertainment shows, well, they have their roots in the past as well. Family Ties, Hill Street Blues. Uh, Misfits of Science. Uh, no, unfortunately, Dave, that's an NBC original. But the point is that no one is innocent in this business, not even NBC. And believe me, it is for the good of television. That's why we have to play along, not to make any waves. And do you have any questions? Yeah, you know that ABC show, 2020? Hugh Downs, now, is he the anchor man? Is he the host, the reporter? Dave, well, look, look, I can't get into that. All I do is take my orders from Mr. Cosby. And by the way, Bill wanted me to tell you that you should put a little more emotion, a little more warmth into your own show. Okay, well, uh, I'll sure try. And he said that you can start by giving me a little hug. All right, David, that's enough. Oh, one more thing, by the way. Would you stop making fun of Brian Gumbel? Oh, okay. All right. Sure. You know, I really learned an awful lot that day. And since that time, believe me, I've tried very hard to make Late Night the warmest show on television. Thank you, good night, and God bless each and every one of you. We'll be right back with Michael Keaton, folks.